Hi, my name is Christina Beaudry and I'm a primary therapist at Milestones in Recovery. And today I want to talk about building boundaries. What are boundaries? Boundaries are what allow us to know where we end and others begin. They're rules and limits that we set for ourselves in relation to other people. So we know how to go ahead and, and communicate and ask for our needs to be met. You know, when we're not our healthiest self, we fall into two, you know, extremes. Either our, our boundaries are too rigid and we have ourselves locked away in a castle. We aren't able to ask for help. We aren't able to connect with others. Others aren't able to connect with us. When we fall into the opposite extreme, we fall into too porous or too loose of a boundary. And what happens then is basically it's like leaving our front door open. We are allowing anyone in, anyone out. You know, it's like meeting a person for the first time and they all of a sudden know your life story because there isn't any kind of, you know, wait, let me, let me not do that. Let me not let them in because I don't know that they're deserving yet. So what I want to talk about is how, how can we go ahead and identify when we need to set a boundary? And the usual answer there is, you know, when I'm getting that, that kind of pit in my stomach, when I'm starting to feel angry, resentful, hurt, or depressed, usually I'm not using my voice. And that, that can lead to, to many things. In that I work at Milestones in Recovery, we deal, that leads to food. That leads to picking up, you know, our eating disorder behavior. So what we want to do is work on using our voice, identifying what we need, and learning how to ask for it. And my recommendation would be to take a pause, take a step back, you know, what it, and sit with yourself and try and listen to that inner voice. What, what am I, what do I need? What do I want? How do I ask for it? Usually it's, you know, I need to ask somebody to, to not talk about something that is triggering for me. Or I need to, you know, let a family member know that we don't talk about my weight anymore because that's not safe for me. So identifying what it is and then making sure that you're in a calm, centered place when you ask for your needs to be met. So not in the middle of a fight, not when you're just overly, you know, anxious and you're kind of just, you know, all over the place, but try and take a t deep breath, center yourself, and then enter into the conversation calm, clear, connected to what your message is, and ask for it without apologizing. You don't have to apologize for setting a boundary. They're necessary, they're important, and they're what allow you to feel important. You're showing yourself you're worth it. So approach the person, ask for your boundary to be met, and as long as your side of the street is clean, you're doing what you need to do. I think that's all. Thanks so much and I hope you have a great day. Bye-bye.